It is 644 this morning and now we turn to a TV tree 11 morning original you won't see anywhere else. And what better way to spread a little Christmas spirit than music? Now members of the Cabot High School band will soon be getting to put on a performance many around the world would dream of as they head to Carnegie Hall. All new this morning, Wake Up Central shows you how they're preparing for a trip to the Big Apple. Ready and... Cabot Band's director, Rusty Hart, likes what he hears. Good, 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 good. But there is still work to be done for the next performance. Slowly but surely, we're getting all the all the pieces in place, all the check marks checked, and, uh, and it's almost time to go. Let's, let's go back to American Fanfare, all right? After all, practice, man, practice. That's how you get to Carnegie Hall. He just kind of nonchalantly just sort of like, was like, we're going to go to New York. A series of fortunate events landed Cabot an invitation, along with Russellville and Arkansas Tech, to play in the Big Apple. The director at Arkansas Tech called me and said, hey, we're going to try to make Carnegie happen this year. The group from Cincinnati backed out. Would you like to take their place? And we were like, absolutely, we're in, let's go. An opportunity percussionist Brandon Reynolds couldn't have drummed up in his wildest dreams. It was crazy to think about because, like, I mean, the Beatles have played there, which is just wild. Senior Ashley Muller can't wait for this band to come together on the stage where so many icons have before. We've had all these practices kind of leading up to it, but I seriously don't think it'll completely feel real until we're actually there on the stage at Carnegie. It'll be a first for all 48 members of this band to take this stage. For half, it'll be the first time they've ever been on a plane. You know, and we have literally talked to them about, you know, this is how you handle the airports. Be sure you don't carry this on the plane. And when we're in the big city, you know, walking places, you know, how to handle yourself. Monday morning, they'll pack their sheet music and instrument, of course, ready to light up New York City. Maybe one day I could, like, tell my kids when they're in band or something that, you know, I did this and uh, that's been pretty cool. Definitely be something I probably never forget for the rest of my life. All of us, for sure. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity for those kids and they're so excited. They've been working so hard. They've been practicing for this performance since August. And it, wow. so many milestones for them. The first time for some of them flying. Oh yeah, it's big time. And then time. going the, for the first time to Carnegie. Oh, or New York City. I mean, New York City, yeah. Carnegie, and, and they're doing the whole thing, too, because the performance is so special, but the trip in itself is amazing, amazing. too. Amazing. just loading 48 high school kids onto a plane and, you know, <laughs> going to the biggest city mm -hmm. uh, That's gonna in, be the, one in the heck U.S. Of a flight. Oh, it's going to be amazing, yeah, loading <laughs> yeah. up the Cabot High School, you know, charter flight. Representing Arkansas. <laughs> well, they New get York. up there, and exactly, that's mm -hmm. the best part. They get to represent Cabot, get to represent Arkansas, too, and they're going to see everything you can see in New York City during Christmas time. I will time. never forget the first time <laughs> I went to New York City and just, like, stepping out of the oh. car and you're just like yes. wow it's just yeah. so different so. i used it to is. intern so. there and i i miss it yeah. i miss it so it's amazing how fun <laughs> wednesday night they're performing yeah. cool.